Okay, so we're gonna make another cube next to that one. So we're gonna put one in the right and one in the left. Silico with the bead. Make another cluster of four by putting one in the right and one in the left. And then silico. And then to form the cube, we're gonna put uh, one bead on the right and one on the left. And we're gonna silico to this bead here to form the cube cluster. So now we have that. There's going to be two cubes on top of the A. So now we're going to make a slanted uh, a slanted cube to form the second post of the letter A. So we're going to insert our string here on the bottom part of the second cube that we made. Take your other string and put it in the opposite side. So here's where we're gonna make a slanted cube. Okay? Okay, so what we need to do is we're gonna put uh, one bead on the right and one bead on the left to form the first cluster of four. And whenever we make a slanted cube, we always do uh, three clusters of four before we close the cube. So one on the left and one on the right and then silico so up and do it one more time. So now we have two. So we need another one. So we need to put one on the right and one on the left and then silico and then we're gonna put one on the right and one on the left and we're gonna silico to that part of the the same the same bead that we made the clusters from the leak up there it's pretty hard to show you guys it's a little bit tricky but once you get the hang of it it is okay that is the slanted cube right there so now we're gonna form the uh, uh, three more cubes on the bottom part of that okay okay guys so now that we're here na, on the first part of the second post uh, we're gonna take one of the string and insert it through certain beads at the bottom it's either this one here or the other one so just insert it there take the other string and put it on the opposite side so that we can make the second cube for the second post we need to do is to make two clusters of four so put one bead on the right and one on the left silico make another cluster of four one on the left and one on the right and silico 
and here so we're gonna form the second cube so put one in the left and one in the right and since we're here we're gonna sleep up to this part here of the other cube so leak up there tighten as you go so now we're here we're gonna make another another cube so insert your right stain to this lead here at the bottom and take your other string going the opposite side so we're gonna make another cluster of or another cube the third one put one on the left and one on the right and then silica make another cluster of four by putting one on the right and one on the left and then silica and then we're gonna form the cube so i'm gonna put one in the left and one in the right and then silica up to the other side to form the cube silica up there align both of the ends so now you have that So after that, we're going to form the last cube here for the second post. So put your string, your left string, to the bottom cube, the bottom part of the cube. Take the other one and go the opposite side. And then we're going to form the last cube for the second post of the A. Of the a. Uh, put one in the right and one in the left to start the cube. Make the first cluster of four. Then make another cluster of four. One in the left and one in the right. And then sleep up. So now we have that. So we're gonna put one in the left and one in the right. So that you can form the last cube by making a silicone on this part here. Align both ends for. So the next one is the middle part. Okay. Okay, guys. So I went ahead and inserted my string uh, in between the four cubes. So there's two cubes up and two cubes down and I inserted it here in this inside with here. So here's where we're gonna make a cube. So we're gonna make two clusters of four. So put one on the right and one on the left. And then salipo. Make another cluster of four by putting one on the left and one on the right. And silica. Up. And then we're gonna close that middle cube on the middle part of the A by putting one on the left and one on the right. And then we're going to silica up here. So we were here and now, now we're going to this way. So insert your string there. Take your other string and go the opposite side. So now we have that first cube in between the letters or the letter A. So we're just gonna put our string through this bit here so that we can connect it. To the other side so what we're gonna do since we have that 
we're gonna get one bead and insert it to the first string and then insert that string to the other side to fill that hole there take your other string put a bead there and go the opposite side So now we have filled that part of the A. So now, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna fill the upper part. So get your string inserted here. And then put a bead there. And insert it to the middle bead here. So we can fill that hole or fill that cluster of four. Go to the opposite or turn your work around. Take your other string, insert it to the bead here. Put a bead there. And then insert it to the middle bead there. So now we have formed the letter A now. So since we have some left string, we're just going to insert it through a series of beads. And since it is now here, I have noticed that this part is a little bit loose. I wasn't able to tighten it. So what you can do is, since we have some leftover string, we can tighten that part by passing through several beads as we go. Just to tighten that part up and make it more solid. And after passing the string through several beads, you can just cut it. And now your letter A is formed. So this is going to be the first part of our tutorial for the alphabet series. And I hope that you enjoyed working on them as much as I enjoy uh, teaching them to you. Uh, as you know, the next one will be the letter B. And it's a little bit bulky and you can't really see the hole that well but this is how it is done so you can put a key ring on it so that you can put it on your bag so that is the the end of our tutorial for today if you have comments or suggestions please put them on the comment box below all of the details about this project is going to be on the towel section or the description box. Uh, any other details, I'm going to put on my blog if I'm able to put it there. So, that's it from me. Bye to you guys for now.